This brief video will show you how to use the app Teachly Animal Adventure in your classroom for your younger students. First of all, I'm going to tap on the red ribbon in the bottom right hand of the screen that says Teachers, Create a Class. As a teacher, you can set up an account with Teachly. If you do this, it will allow you to monitor your student activity as well as allow each of your students to pick up exactly where they left off every time they use this app. For now, I'm going to X out. To use the app, you simply tap on the arrow with the circle around it. The app then goes into the long story about the adventure, which students love, but for now I'm going to go ahead and skip. And I'm also going to skip this screen. It's another just kind of fun student-driven screen. And here is the meat of the app. What it will do is it will show a math problem on the top of the screen and then it gives you different ways to solve the problem. As you see below, there are three different ways that are highlighted to solve this problem. Each problem will have its unique set highlighted so students can solve the problems in the way that makes the most sense to them. I'm going to turn the sound on and demonstrate one of the methods quickly. Perhaps I shall take a little nappy poo. I'm going to choose the count on method to demonstrate. Choose which number to start with. I'll choose the three by tapping on it. Hold on to three and then count on two more. So the student says three, taps on one block, four, taps on another, five. Once the student has the correct answer, they take their finger and slide it to the correct one on the number line. 3 plus 2 equals 5. They then get immediate feedback. Again, I'm going to turn the sound off. So you can see as the game progresses, you can choose different methods and learners can choose which way works for them. The problems will get more difficult as the student increases in their knowledge and they will also have more options on the way that works for them to solve the problem. When the student is done, they may tap their finger on the little house icon in the top right hand corner and I will ask them if they want to stop playing.